This video is going to show you how to use some of the built-in formulas in Google Docs spreadsheet. To begin with, in the acceleration column, that's the D column, I know that all these values are supposed to be the same, but they're not. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to find their average and find out what the error is. So I'm going to click on the cell where I want the information to occur, that's where it says average, and underneath that column. And what I'm going to do is double click inside of here, press an equal sign to tell them I'm going to do a formula. Then I'll go to insert, and down to formula, and it gives me a short menu, and then more formulas. In this case, I can just do the average. I could do sum and count, or I can just do average, and there is a difference. Right now, we'll just do the average formula. So I'll click on average. It gives me the word, that's the command it uses, and the parentheses. Now I need to tell it what to find the average of. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight these cells. So as I highlight them, you can see it changes down below. I'm going to let go, it's all set. Now I've got to finish the command by using a close parentheses. You must finish the command for it to work. And then I'll press the enter, or return key, or enter key, and it does the calculation. So that's the average of the numbers. And I'm going to go ahead and center them just like I did the other stuff. And underneath that I want the error. So I'm going to use the standard deviation to find the error. So I'm going to go to insert again, formula. But this time it's not in my short list. So I've got to go here where it says more formulas. This is something statistical. So I'll just look up statistics, statistical. And I'll go down and I'm looking for something that looks like an abbreviation for standard deviation, which I've already selected. STDEV. So I'll double click on that. And that's all set. And I'll close my window. And there it's there. That's the command STDEV equals, and then it's got these parentheses. I'm going to delete the stuff in parentheses and just highlight that section numbers again. So now I have two parentheses, and in between them, I'm going to highlight that information in the acceleration column by dragging the mouse down. I release, and it's all set. I hit return, and it's all there. Now, I want to do the same thing for the force. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight my cell, and I'm going to click on that little box and drag it to the right, fill to the right. And then I'll take my little box, and I'll fill to the right. So this is the average force, and this is the error in the measurements of the average force. Remember, I can also go up and format it as well.